And a brand new travel warning in Local 10's Janine Stanwood is live now at MIA with what the State Department is telling Americans to do. Janine. Calvin, the State Department is urging Americans not to travel to Haiti and now ordering most government officials to get out of there. With kidnappings and chaos on the street, the U.S. government is updating its travel warning to Haiti, ordering non-emergency government personnel and their families out of the country. The State Department said U.S. citizens not working for the government should also leave as soon as possible. Here at MIA, there's one inbound flight from Port-au-Prince this Friday. Mucho cosa malo. Kidnapping. Kidnapping. This man is waiting to pick up family and tells us he worries about the dangers there. The country has been in turmoil. Video shows families camped out at the U.S. Embassy. This woman says they've been kicked out of their homes by gangs. But they would soon be evicted and back out in danger. Haiti has not elected a new leader since President Jovenel Moise was assassinated two years ago. And that flight from Port-au-Prince, we understand, has landed, but those folks are right now clearing customs. We've spoken to at least one person in Haiti today who said it was a dangerous situation that's happening, and it's only getting worse. If you want to see that entire travel warning, we have that up on our website, local10.com. We're at Miami International Airport. I'm Janine Stanwood, Local 10 News.